Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to be doing my baby shower haul, part one, because this is gonna be all the clothes. And I'm kind of glad that I'm down here <laughs> recording because after the baby shower, we took all the clothes down here. That way they were by the washing machine. And when I was ready to wash them, all I had to do was cut the tags. So, that's why I'm down here recording all of the clothes because then I would have to carry them all the way back upstairs with everything else and try to record up there where I would have realized that it would take way too long just to get through the clothes. So, I'm glad it worked out this way though. The lighting is really horrible, so I apologize in advance for that. If I were like way back here, I would look a lot better because the light's right. But uh, then I'd be really far away, <laughs> so you have to look at my face like this, and I know I look like utter crap, but uh, let's get into the clothes because there is a lot of them. So the thing with my baby shower is that in the description I mentioned that if people did not know what to get me or they did not want to get me something off the registry to that a card would be okay or, you know, like a gift card, a card with cash, whatever. I didn't specify a card with cash, but I said a card would be fine. Like, I obviously don't expect people to get me things, but I specifically said, <laughs> we don't really need clothes. We're good on clothes. And we have this giant pile, this giant heaping pile of clothes. Granted, a very few of these things were actually on my registry, and I'll try to point them out when we get to them, but the rest of these things were not. And even though I didn't necessarily want a bunch of clothes, I'm also not going to sit here and say like that I'm ungrateful. I'm very grateful that people cared this much, friends and family cared this much to get us this many things. Our son is not going to go without clothes, that's for sure, because I already have a ton that, like, me and Jared ourselves bought and collected over time. That way we didn't have to worry about clothes, but apparently that's what people like to buy the most of. <laughs> but, uh, anyway, let's get into it. Alright, so here's a little shirt. It's got a hedgehog holding a net and driving a scooter size six to nine months. Pants to match, and I'm pretty sure this also goes with it, and it's supposed to be like the sweatshirt over the shirt, and it's got a bunch of vehicles on it. Next we have this Mickey Mouse. I don't know if you wanna call, I wouldn't call this a sleeper, this is probably more like a jumper. I don't know what you call these one pieces that are like open feet with a hood because it definitely can't have a child sleeping in this. This is three to six months. Now we also have this. This is probably like a boy's romper. I don't know what to call these things. But yeah, it's just a cute little plaid romper. This is a nine to 12 month piece. So I guess I'm happy because people did buy other sizes. If it was a bunch of like newborn or three months or six months even. <laughs> that would have sucked because I already got like a lot of that. We have a newborn sleeper. It is brown with like a bunch of little animals on it. There's bears, foxes, hedgehogs, squirrel, sloth, a raccoon. Yep. There's also like a moose or something on here. And we have one with an elephant on it. Okay, so this FET was on my registry. This is the Cloud Island brand from Target, which is a really great brand if you guys didn't know. But um, basically you can get like a set of three sleepers. This one's obviously striped, black and white stripes on the main part and gray and white. And of course these are newborns so they have the little flip sleeve here so you can cover their hands. And I really like this detail. It's like a teal button and there's also teal stitching. So I just love this brand because it's so different. I don't know. Then you got this gray with dark gray 
polka dots and again the sleeves and the teal and this one is white with hedgehogs and you got the teal going on again and then i believe this one was on the registry as well this set actually matches the sleepers i just showed you with their newborn onesies all of these have the teal stitching as well and then you got the hedgehog one to match the sleeper we have a polka dot one this is white and black and then a gray one that says hi we have another newborn sleeper this one has animals on it it's got hippos rhinos giraffes whales turtles clouds this was on my registry as well because i realized that i had a ton of onesies for him as a newborn but like no pants to go with it so i put these on the registry it's just a pair of gray and a pair of blue because a lot of the shirts are like patterned or something and i figured get more solid colored pants but of course i have I think I have more pants now because I found some of Riley's like old pants that were gender neutral or they were just like jeans, which you can obviously use with both genders. So I think he's good on pants now, but obviously once I wash everything and put it all away and see how much I have of everything, I'll know for sure what I have and like what I still need, but I don't think I'm gonna need anything else at this point as far as clothes go. <laughs> and then the other thing that was on my registry are these hats. Um, again, they pretty much go with the outfits I just showed you. They're meant to kind of match that theme. It's just a black one, a gray one, and a striped one. This is a four to six month outfit, which is very weird size. I think it's the brand of this. It's called Mayoral. I don't know where this came from. But again, it's like a one piece, uh, short pants, by then it should be like summertime so it's just a cute little thing with a look it looks like they're overalls but they're not we have a three month sleeper it's fleece material and there's a little cloud on it we have a elephant hooded towel so like this is the hood <laughs> this is really cute at the time of my baby shower this was the only towel that i received i had three or two sets of three on my registry that nobody bought um i actually went today and picked up some more stuff so stay tuned for kind of like a part two um it's going to be just a baby haul in general of things i went out to buy after my baby shower up next we have a zero to three month uh set it comes with a hat a short sleeve shirt onesie and some gray pants. Okay, we have this sleeper with a bunch of sloths, sloths on it. And it's one of those two-way zippers, which are really, really great. This is three to six months. We have nine month onesies in short sleeve. Whoever got me this, good looking out because I don't have a lot of nine month stuff right now. And obviously like I'm not worried about it just yet, but it's nice to have it. So this one says handsome little fella. This one has bears on it. This one is just plain striped because there's nothing on that side. This one has little houses, cars, bears, and triangles on it. And then this one says baby bear, hey there. We have a baby throw. So it's uh, a blanket. <laughs> It's a baby throw blanket, and it's obviously got a bunch of letters on it. And the inside is just completely white. Um, this is really soft. We have a six month outfit here. Um, it's a shirt with rocket ship and space related things with these pants that have this little <laughs> fold and it's striped, which is pretty cool. That's pretty cool. And we have a six to nine month sleeper with rocket ship and I really like the colors of this and the pattern the stars and then of course like the tealish blue color we have going on here <laughs> and there's a little monkey astronaut on the feet we have a zero to six month sleeper this is one of those gown ones where you can wear it this way or you can uh 
unbutton it and rebutton it to be legs as it shows in the picture. We have a three to six month set. This one comes with a hat and socks, a bib that says I'm new here, and the shirt says that too apparently. And then you got the pants with all the letters and clouds and the sun. So that's really cute. This might have gone with the very first outfit that I showed you, I think. I can't be certain, but uh, it's a reversible hat that is supposed to be worn in the summertime, obviously to shield baby from the sun. This is 12 to 18 months though, so he won't be able to wear this until like two summers. Okay, this outfit is really, really adorable. Just warning you right now, it is a two to four month. That's such a weird size. Okay, well this tag says three months, but whatever. It's this cute little sweatshirt, and I really love the, uh, like, the textured look, if that's what you want to call it. Actual little pocket, and it's like a little puppy dog. And obviously, like, you got stars on the sleeves. I just really love gray. And then there's little pants to match. And I just really love these colors. The fact that there's, like, actual little pockets here is really cute. We have another weird two to four month or three month um, sleeper. This is a very weird like fleece-ish material. I don't even know what to call it because it's not like that on the inside. But uh, yeah, this one has little trains on it. All these weird brands and whatnot are from my mother-in-law. I don't know where she finds these things, honestly. Oh, kids clothesline apparently. Kids clothesline. This actual brand is Angel Deer. This is 6 to 12 months. It feels like a swaddle blanket. Like that's a very interesting material. That's what it feels like. So yeah, this looks super huge. It's super wide. There's a bunch of Vikings on it. 6 months. It says... I can get the tag out of the way. Daddy's Football Buddy. We have a 3 month fleece sleeper by Carter's. And I know I didn't really mention any of the brands during this entire video, but, but yeah, this has tigers and a koala and panda and bear. All right, we have a 9 to 12 month Disney baby outfit. This definitely looks like pajamas. It says just a little cat nap with Simba. It looks like Simba. And matching pants. And another Disney baby 3 to 6 month like one piece type outfit. I really like this. <laughs> it's like little knee pads. As if a baby's gonna be crawling that early, but still. 101 Dalmatians is the theme here. And there's an actual little pocket right there. We got the open feet though. We have a six month Carter's outfit. It's a little baby basics. Carter's has like a million freaking little lines. Like, But anyway, this one comes with a little hat. Cute little socks, looks like bare faces. And we have a koala, an alligator, a bear, a turtle, and a dog. And it says, little friends. And then we have these little pants with a, like, full-on pocket in the front. That's interesting. And that little bow. We have a Disney Jumping Beans outfit. Three months. It's Winnie the Pooh and Eeyore. I couldn't think of his name for a second, and I'm totally not in the picture. Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, we've got the onesie, and then we have, like, I think this is ribbed. I don't know if that's the fabric or not, but it's like a ribbed type of pant with Winnie the Pooh and Eeyore and a bunch of mushrooms and bees. And last but not least, we have a three-month Carter's Little Baby Basics set. Short sleeve says Daddy's Sidekick. They're little monsters. We got some pants to match, and then we have a sleeper as well that goes with it. So there you have it. <laughs> That's all the clothes that I got from the baby shower. And if you can't see the massive pile behind me, that just goes to show like how much we got. And obviously some of them were hats and towels and blankets. 
I do have plenty more things to show you guys. Obviously, there is going to be a part two because this video itself took extremely long to record due to the fact of how much stuff there was to show you. So there is going to be a part two. Even though this video looks like crap, I wish I could have thrown it into the other one, but then that would have been really, really, really long and that would have taken a really long time to uh, not only edit, but like upload as well. So thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it at all, seeing all the clothes, <laughs> and I will see you guys for the next part. Thank you and goodbye.